to Gourmet and Grapes. Hope you have a great evening tonight. Six stations to get around, food and wine. And of course, in one hour, the black box begins. We're at Cabana Bar and Grill. We're hosting the third round of Gourmet and Grapes. And what Gourmet and Grapes is about is about celebrating the pairing of food and wine. We've got amazing winemakers in the valley, as most people know. We also have some fantastic chefs. So what we do is we pair them up together. And uh, at this event in particular, we've got six of the top chefs of the Okanagan paired up with six of the top wineries. So what guests get to do is they get to go around, mill about, and taste food that's been paired with wine. The main event is an Iron Chef competition. Most people have seen Iron Chef with Iron Chef America or the original Iron Chef. Uh, chef Ned Bell is going against Paul Ciccone from Local. First time at the Iron Chef here. What's what's your thoughts? I'm excited. No, looking uh, very much forward to it. It's going to be fantastic. You think you're going to be the one to finally take Ned Bell down? I hope so. <laughs> I'll do my best. Well, you know, I, obviously I was lucky to win those first two, so hopefully I'm lucky again tonight. But uh, Paul better bring his A game because I brought mine. These two chefs have got one hour to create three of the best dishes possible with a secret ingredient, a la Iron Chef. The secret ingredient is. Oyster. It's about good food, good wine, and an Irish chef competition. We're going to do an uh, oyster uh, soup velouté uh, with uh, oyster beignet. Uh, we're going to try uh, doing uh, uh, oyster sliders three different ways and uh, some oyster pierogies. The best man wins. <laughs> 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 
So the first course I've done uh, oysters two ways. I've done a little oyster and tequila shooter with a sesame, uh, a sesame praline on top. Uh, underneath is pickled uh, cucumber, avocado, a little bit of yogurt, a maple soy glaze, and then an oyster vinaigrette with pickled shallots and radish sprouts. Next dish is a uh, homemade pasta. We made it from scratch in the beginning, like from beginning, uh, with an oyster velouté. Inside the oyster velouté is, is lemon, there's some asparagus, some fresh mint, a little bit of shaved pecorino. Uh, Cabana is going to be famous because we're now going to make all of our pasta in house, so come and try it all. And then uh, last dish is uh, a, a, sorry, quinoa salad, quinoa crust on top of a beef tenderloin, a little bit of oyster tempura, and then an arugula uh, sauce with a little bit of oyster liquor. You know, out of a total of 1,500 points available, it was very close. Okay, 1,500 points. And the winner of tonight's Terrace and Guess Gourmet and Grapes is, and still champion, Ned Bell! Wow, well, uh, I don't really know what to say because Paul, obviously, I mean, you brought it tonight and I, I was really proud to have you in my kitchen and thank you very much and it was a lot of fun. Uh, as, as is tradition here for Gourmet and Grapes, uh, I've uh, got a really cool gift for you that I think you like. Not just to say thank it's you. It's a for picture me. of Ned, actually. Yeah. <laughs> it's a signed picture of, no, it's actually the uh, cookbook from the best restaurant in the world, The Fat Duck. Nice. Wow, thank you. So thank you very much, Paul. I'd also, I'd also like to thank Jimmy James, my uh, my executive chef here, our executive chef. Jimmy organized everything tonight. All of our sponsors, of course, and uh, my uh, my my sous chef this evening, Aaron Ng, and also uh, Paul's sous chef, George, and everybody in the back that actually is doing dishes. No thanks to any of you guys. And Ned, I'd like to thank our uh, hardworking but slowly digesting judges. From GoGo -Go Magazine, Taryn Parker, Maxine DeHart, Sandy Dawson. Sandy. I see, Sandy's like, I, have I, I, see, I see Tim Paws, he's already purging. <laughs> I would like to hand the microphone over to Paul quickly just to say a couple of things. Paul? Well, no, thanks, uh, thanks, Ned, for uh, for having me here. It was a, uh, a privilege. Uh, had lots of fun here, and uh, uh, you know, congratulations to you uh, for winning that. And uh, you know, it's uh, it, yeah, fantastic to be a part of it. So, thanks, thanks again. Much. Thanks. Awesome. I'm humbled. And just as we wrap up, I just want to remind you that this is a safe ride home event. See the ladies at the front for more details of that. And thank you all for joining us at the third installment we'll of Gourmet and Grape. We'll see you in the autumn. We'll see you in the fall. Thank you so much.